Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew. Daily events worldwide. And we are on February 22nd, 2021. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet. And welcome to a quick video here. I wanted to really show the dynamics of the sun, what we're going through right now. Because I do believe that this is a one-of-a-kind event. The large plasma filament that snapped away onto the sun two days ago has instantly changed the sun as I said it might. We're just looking at the old images here, incoming and outgoing images of the large plasma filament that snapped and sent a tsunami wave across half of the sun. One of the largest plasma filament eruptions I've seen fall back onto the sun. And you can see it changed the sun instantly as it sent the tsunami across. And I thought that most likely it will activate the sunspot activity as there was one coming, but did not activate that one particularly. All we've been seeing recently have been coronal holes, plasma filaments, not much sunspot activity, which we've been expecting now in solar cycle 25, a maximum solar cycle. So that one incoming sunspot did let out a CME, a small one. We'll be expecting that within the 48 hours, a glancing blow. And luckily, this plasma filament didn't snap away from the sun at an Earth-facing position. Because this, as I say, could be once-in-a-lifetime event. And our sun could be going through a once-in-a-lifetime event as well. Is it ironic that these articles and papers are coming out about the geomagnetic reversal over the last couple days? And then all of a sudden this pops out. You can see here instantly that two sunspots formed at an Earth-facing position just now. And in the last few images here, a couple of them, or sorry, the one in the northern region did let out a couple small flares earth facing the one in the bottom region looks to be coupled with it antipode to the sun so there's definitely a magnetic anomaly happening right now on the sun due to the pl large plasma filament that snapped onto the sun looking here at 304 ang angstroms you can really see the flash from those two now active sunspots. So as I thought, we instantly have an activation into solar cycle 25. We have two brand new sunspots to talk about and incoming space weather over the next 48 hours. Currently, we are still steady at over 500 kilometers per second, our solar wind speed. So quite possibly what I'm talking about with these articles and which I mentioned yesterday in a video. Scientists are discovering that quite possibly the sun did something cataclysmic 42,000 years ago. So looking here at our sun, we're definitely going to be monitoring closely over the next little while, especially the next couple of days as Solar Cycle 25 is here. And I want to thank everybody for watching and tuning in to Morning Dew and choosing Morning Dew, daily events worldwide, keeping humanity aware and prepared to world weather, space weather, earthquakes, volcanoes, and anything that affects mankind. And here you can see the active sunspots, the 
green and the blue and the yellows and the orange. When you start to see those colors, keeping an eye on these. Thanks for watching today. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning due. Bye-bye now. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.